interest, considering the fact that the fact that all of these issues that you have reported transpired in another jurisdiction may not have any effect whatsoever here in Nigeria because it's not something emanating from our courts. Are you aware of anybody within the Nigerian jurisdiction taking this up as an issue? So, with regard to the, the, the drug trafficking in itself, um, in that it didn't take place um, in the Nigerian jurisdiction. So, um, as a legal issue, strictly speaking, in Nigeria, it's non existent because it took place uh, in the US. Um, so, um, on the basis of that, it's going to be very difficult to um, make this a legal issue. However, there are ancillary issues which I know for a fact are being taken up now. Um, Probably either later today or before the end of the week, um, this is going to emerge. So I, I guess I'm, you know, I have the privilege of breaking this on national TV. I happen to know for a fact that uh, a lawyer who is based in the FCT is actually taking up some of these issues um, independently. Um, he has filed a criminal complaint, which should have been actually served on Bolatimbo yesterday. If it wasn't served yesterday, it should be served today. And these issues are with regard to the fact that um, he has essentially committed perjury. On his, on his ANEC EC9 declaration. So um, some of the, the documents submitted were, were falsified. Some of the claims he made, such as um, having claimed to, to, to have been employed at Deloitte LLP, are manifestly false. We've gone to the extraordinary extent of obtaining subpoenas for um, his, his purported former workplaces, his, his, uh, uh, his former schools, uh, at Richard J. Daly College, Chicago State University, and there are all sorts of discrepancies. Right, and this person has submitted falsified documents to INEC, and those are on his on his INEC nine declaration. So this issue is actually being taken up by by this lawyer. Um, actually, I'm going to name the lawyer. Um, his name is uh, um, Mike Enaro, Mike Enaro So um, this action should have 